I am so excited about introducing you to your next senior pastor. His name is Andy Bryan, and I thought, coming from Springfield, that he might appreciate uh, Welcome to St. Louis or Welcome to Manchester United Methodist gift or two. So let's welcome Andy Bryan. Oh, uh, oh, oh. Uh, yeah. I, I already have a hat. Yeah, Greg. I, yeah. it's blue. It's it, it, yes, it is. Royal blue. It's, yes, it is. So, <laughs> okay. Well, but Andy, it's mm. okay. It's okay. Bowling is a big sport in St. Louis. We have many, but everybody bowls in St. Louis. So, I have a gift for you. I have a black bowling ball because oh. real bowlers bowl with black That's, bowling ball. So, Andy, here so, is. I, a, let, let me just. I don't bowl. Okay. Um, well, maybe, Andy, what we need to do is get a little bit better acquainted. That's How about that? That's a great idea. Let's, let's, let's do that. Let's have a seat. Yeah. Okay, so, Andy, tell me a little bit about yourself and your interests. Well, I mean, other than Royals baseball and not bowling, I, I do have a lot of interests. Uh, I'm married to Aaron. We've been married for 26 years. We have three kids, two of them in college and one of them second grader. Um, we're a foster family. We've been fostering mm. for 14 years, and we've had over 20 foster kids over that time. That's one of the things that we're really passionate about. I, I enjoy music. My first degree, and Aaron's degree, actually, is, is in music. And so uh, I like to compose music. I like to sing, uh, and um, that's a big passion for both of us. Uh, I also, one last thing that I kind of like to do is get outside. I, I like to hike and camp and ah. canoe and that kind of stuff, too. Um, I, that's kind of stuff that makes me tick. That is a natural fit here, obviously, with our music and with, uh, yeah. with the St. Louis area. Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad to hear that. Now, I do know your dad, and I did know your right. granddad. I yeah. know you come from a long line of pastors, so you would have known a little bit about Manchester United sure. Methodist Church. So what are your thoughts and maybe some of your dreams? Well, I, it's a great congregation. It's, it's got a lot of activity. I, I am just overwhelmed by the number of opportunities for discipleship that people have here. Mm -hmm. There are so many small groups to be a part of and also so many programs and, and mission opportunities uh, all around the community, all around the world. And um, it's just a dynamic, a dynamic uh ethos that this mm -hmm. congregation really has, and I'm so excited to be a part of that. Um, the, like you said, the music, the history, those are things that are, are really uh, prominent in Manchester's identity, um, but above and beyond all that, I think, is the amazing future that God has in store for this congregation as we continue to just be faithful to who God wants us to be as the church. I, I, God's doing amazing things throughout, not just this congregation, but throughout the church and the world, and it's an exciting time to be a part of it, for sure. Absolutely. Well, quite seriously, one of the strengths of Methodism, I think, is the appointment system, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that clergy are not supposed to be all alike. We're supposed to have different gifts and graces, and it That's certainly right. sounds like yours will uh, fit here and take uh, Manchester United Methodist Church into the vision that God has for it. In the future. Well, it's very kind of you to say. I'm grateful for your years of service here and all that you've done. We are, we are alike in many ways and different in many. And I think mm -hmm. that is a strength of, of our beautiful denomination. And so um, I feel really good about starting July 1 and, and seeing where God takes this congregation. Excellent. Well, please know that you have the, the thoughts and prayers of uh, 3,200 members plus staff and me as you awesome. make the transition. I know it's pretty... Uh, anxious time, but it is a very hopeful time as well, right. especially for our congregation with you and your family being here. Well, I really appreciate that, Greg. Thanks a lot. Yeah, you're welcome. And, and Andy, just I do want to make sure that you know that I think you will look really good in cardinal red and blue. I, I thank you for that. I, I feel like I need to be true to myself, and yet I'm all about inclusion. Look at that. Amen.